Check this out. Yet yeah, SpaceX has unveiled an upgraded passenger version of the Dragon cargo ship, which NASA buys for resupply runs to the International Space Station. The unveiling of the Dragon V2 took place at the Southern California headquarters of Space Exploration Technologies. Billionaire technology entrepreneur Elon Musk has called the spacecraft a big leap forward in technology. It, conceivably, we could do the first uh, flight to, to orbit, um, and we'd initially do it without people, at the end of next year. Um, and then the first flight uh, with people uh, in, in 2016, we think, is, is very achievable. SpaceX is just one of several private companies competing to build so-called taxis for NASA to replace the retired space shuttle fleet. It previously flew four cargo missions to the space station, delivering food and supplies. Since the shuttle fleet retired in 2011, NASA has depended on Russian rockets to transport astronauts to orbit and back, paying nearly $71 million per seat. The space agency has said it wants U.S. companies to fill the void by 2011 and has given out seed money to spur innovation. So, that is how a 21st century spaceship should land. <laughs>